Good morning, Texans. I'm Jared, and this is Texan TV. The Texan Student Media Department is looking for creative, hardworking, and self-driven individuals to join newspaper or yearbook next year. If you're interested, please follow us on Twitter at SHHS Texan Media for the link to the application. Interested in a strategic social game where you fight other players until you're the last one standing? Come join the Magic of the Gathering Club in room 1313 every Wednesday at 3 p.m. You don't need anything to get started, and there will be plenty of people to help you out. Come and bring a friend. JK Living has started their second semester of fun. All grade levels are welcome. This semester, we have great plans uh, for community service like 5Ks, cooking demonstrations, guest speakers, and field trips. They meet every Mondays and Thursdays in room 921. Come check it out and bring a friend. Mark your calendars for every Wednesday and come join us for the AOC, Art of the Covenant Bible Study. Find out all they have planned, meet new friends, and enjoy learning amazing new things while enjoying snacks. They meet in room 907 from 310 to 4 p.m. Bring a friend and they'll see you there. And here's a segment that will have you asking, do you even go to class? Hello there, America, my uh, fellow Texans. Today we're doing a, do you even go to class? Today we're going to ask some questions to the teachers and the students. Can I get your names from right to left? Juan Valerian. Jennifer Metter. David Pellerin. Henry Dent. Are you all ready? Yeah. Yes. Let's go. Let's go. Woo! We're ready. For your first question, I must ask you, what does... PEMDAS stand for Parentheses, Exponent, Multiplication, Division, Addition, Subtraction. We were first. No, you weren't. He gave us the answer. Please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. It's okay. Go. <laughs> Give them the point. It's okay. They're cheating. <laughs> Are we cheating? You literally pulled the table so I closed the <laughs> And your hands are on the table. <laughs> I don't even you know what you're talking about. Hand. Team two gets the point. For question two. Okay. How many precedents has there been? 45. Correct. <laughs> And that was <laughs> <laughs> not a math question. <laughs> all right, all right. I didn't even yeah, know that. Yeah, you didn't get the math one, though. <laughs> <laughs> Rub it in. For your next question, yeah. what is the official state flower? Oh, y'all don't even want to try? <laughs> well, know, uh, that would be the blue bonnet. Correct. For your next question, who wrote the Harry Potter books? J.K. Rowling. Wow. <laughs> Right. Is that not how you say it? <laughs> yeah, this is good enough. Yeah. Alright, I guess. For the next question, how many states begin with C? Jerry, baby. Three. Right? California. Yes! California, Colorado, and Connecticut. Oh, I was gonna say Kentucky, but Kentucky starts with a <laughs> I was not gonna do that. I was not gonna say Kentucky. <laughs> <laughs> he already knows all the answers. He wrote the questions. I wrote yeah. them like two weeks ago. Well, Team was two asleep. loses a point for cheating. Attention Texans, the Black History Month invites you to attend the 2020 Black History Month program at 6.30 p.m. February 21st for the read-in and 6.30 for the performance at the Sam Houston Auditorium. This year's theme is Bridging the Gap. This show is meant to encourage all of us to do our part in bridging the gap with cultural awareness and respect for diversity. The production includes performances from your fellow peers, staff, and members of the community. Please come out and be inspired. Let's make this show a success as we do our part in bridging the gap. And here's our Q&A with Greg and Alejandro. I hate yawn. Question for you today is, what's your funniest childhood memory? Funniest childhood memory? I guess when like I couldn't hold myself to the restroom, so I peed myself uh, because uh, like someone was in the restroom, and so then uh, it took they took long, and I was knocking on the door. And I was like, are you gonna hurry up? And no one answered. And uh, what's it called? I peed myself. It turns out no one's there. It was just locked. It was just locked. <laughs> yeah. So nobody's inside the bathroom? Yeah, no one was inside the restroom. It's like, I was like, oh, well, then I just, I guess, oh, I had to clean myself. I, I don't know. You played yourself right. Yeah, they played me and the yeah. ghost. Yeah, it was ghost just peeing. <laughs> when I got beat up by a duck. You what? 
Oh, um, I have a scar on my knee that I like, I, I broke a perfume, right? And then I just kind of slipped and I fell on it. And I didn't, on the glass of the perfume? Yeah. And then, but I didn't hurt her or anything. I just kind of looked at it and it looked really bad. And then, like, my parents were like freaking out, but I was just sitting there like, oh, um, my funny childhood memory is when I pretended that I was sick to go to the nurse's office to go home, and she called the ambulance, and they took me to the hospital. So you said, the hospital? Yeah. How do you play it off? Huh? How do you play it off? I didn't play it off. I played sick the rest of the day and my, until my mom caught me playing the video game, and she took it. And I eventually told her I lied. Uh, yeah. So I was at the hospital. The hospital, they asked me, they were like, do you want to turn the sirens on? They were thinking, like, I was paranoid. I was like, my mom's going to find out I'm lying and stuff. And then they are like, do you want me to turn on the sirens? I was like, no. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, I was paranoid the whole time. Yo, yo, don't do it. Don't do it. Yo. Okay, Texans, here's your chance to be in the yearbook. Scan the QR code or follow the Twitter or Instagram at SHHS Texan Media. And finish just one statement. School appropriate answers will be printed in the yearbook. On January 31st, we had 15 mariachi students audition for all region and we had four students make it and one student made alternate. Belen Esquivel made flute, Maria Rojas Caballero and Amy Arevalo made violin, Alejandro Flores made guitarra de gope and David Salcedo made alternate on guitarron. These students will attend a weekend of clinica and perform a concert March 27th and 28th at Northside High School in Fort Worth. Sam Houston Choir is singing the national anthem at the Dallas Mavericks game versus New Orleans Pelicans. On Wednesday, March 4th, we are selling tickets for $30. Ticket sales are open to Sam Houston students, teachers, and friends. Please come by room 704 for more details. Thanks for your support. And here's our soccer game against Martin. Texans, don't forget to buy your yearbook in room 511 or at texanstalk.org for $45. This sale is temporary and it will go up to $50 in May. If you buy it now, you will be interviewed for a guaranteed spot in this year's yearbook. The staff is hard at work to convey this year's theme, the good old days. And we need your support. Again, go buy your yearbook in room 511 or at texanstalk.org for $45 while you still can. Listen up Texans, class of 2021 is having a Valentine's Day cupcake fundraiser Pre-order your cupcake during all lunches for only $1. Cupcakes will be delivered on Valentine's Day with a personalized message. Here's your fun French fact of the week. Jeans, the tough clothing that we wear every day, were created and made in Nîmes, France. Levi Strauss then copied the idea and started making durable clothes for Californian gold diggers in the 1800s. The word denim comes from the French words that mean from the city of Nîmes. The quote of the day is dream it, wish it, do it. And remember Texans, learners today, leaders tomorrow. I'm Jared and this has been Texan TV.